take your front seat experience to witness the revolution of Pinoy music. As the newest online music show is about to plug in the freshest, most unique, most promising Filipino independent music artists to your very own screen. We will amplify their sound and their voices. Then it's your turn to resonate and influence others to hear the sound of the future of Filipino music. Join our community. We are Indie Voices PH. YouTubers. Kamusta, IndieSense? I'm Owen of Beat Per Machine. And I'm Abby of Funky Brew. Welcome, Welcome to Indie, Indie Voices, Voices PH. PH. And this show is proudly powered by no other than Indie Villager Media. Alam mo, ang advocacy ng show na to ay para tumulong sa mga indie artists, indie musicians katulad natin. Correct. Mapa solo, duo, or full band ban yan. Of all music genre. Yes, of course. Paano sila makakasali? Correct. Paano ba? First, you have to subscribe on our YouTube channel. It's Indie Villager Media. Click on the subscribe button. Ngayon na. At lahat ng mga episodes, makikita nyo ang Indie Voices PH. That's right. And ring the bell also para lagi kayong updated sa mga uploads namin. And please, reach us also through our Facebook page, Indie Voices PH. You can send us your messages, your comments, suggestions, and you can share the videos that are uploaded there also. Yeah, so gawin nyo na yan, ha, guys? Okay, feeling ko excited ka ngayon. Sobra, fangirling ako eh. Talaga, ngayon. sige. Sobrang gustong gusto ko tong featured artist natin today kasi hindi lang siya nakilala just because sumabay siya sa daloy ng kung anong uso. That's true. Nakilala siya nang dahil sa tunog niya, dahil sa character niya, and dahil sa style niya. Na-excite ako, ha? I love ha? it, I love it. Na-excite ako, so pakilala na natin. Pakilala na natin. Please all welcome, Melina. Cup my cheeks. Kiss my Melina comes from a musically inclined family that was based in Dubai. She began showing her gift for singing at age two. Her entry into the indie scene was with a rock band called Axel. And needing to find her own style and musicality, she moved on to become the lead vocalist of Thousand Winds, where she earned her live performance training. In 2016, Melina decided to start writing her own original songs and go solo. And that is when she finally met her music soulmate, Tim Kada. You be my American boy, American boy. The duo says their music is still a work in progress. Just like 
Welcome to Indie Voices PH, Melina and team. Thank you, thank you so much yes. for having us. Yes, and thank you so much for gracing the show. Grabe. <laughs> grabe. Yun lang grabe. ang masasabi ko. Yung performance kanina, grabe. Fangirling ako ngayon, Melina. Grabe. Sobra. <laughs> yes, okay, ganito. Pasadahan muna natin, no. Melina, bakit Melina at paano siya nag-start? Diba? Papunta ba kayo sa duo or band? It started out actually as ako. I wanted to make a name for myself. And uh, parang what name na better to use? Ano daw? If not my name, diba? So sabi ko, yung second name ko na lang kasi I'm known for Mara sa, sa parang Mara regular Melina, gigs. Right? Uh, oh. Sa regular gigs, parang Mara ako ganyan. And I have my hair down. So. Eh, influence ko rin si Erica Badu. So, oh, nga eh. Doon siya naging ano. At narinig naman so, yun <laughs> sa influence mo. Oh, oh. 
So ayun. Yes, of course. Of, of course, sa mga hindi nakakilala kay Melina, uh, sumali na po siya sa mga prestigious contest, no? Yes. Okay, so natin papaano, ano, ano, ano yung idea mo bakit sumali ka doon tapos nagpunta ka sa indie? Oh, Can you interesting tell? yun ha, kasi usually, di ba, parang pag nag-indie, mm-hmm. na, ando doon lang, solid exactly. ako, pure ako, indie ako. So, wh- what made you cross over from uh, indie and then going popular? Um, to be honest, parang ayoko rin naman masyado ng, uh, ng attention. Medyo ironic nga eh. Kasi sinasabi nila na parang isang ka nang galing, parang hindi ka naman lumalabas. Tapos so sabi ko, wait lang, I have to be exposed. So, k- kailangan kong gumawa ng paraan. So, I thought yung um, yung yung ganong platform para ma-expose ako, para paglabas ko sa indie, marerecognize nila kung sino. Yes, para makilala. Oh. Okay. Sige, tanongin naman natin si Tim, yung kasama niya. Okay. Tim, paano kayo nagkakilala ni Melina? Ah, yeah. It's a funny story. Actually, um, like what she, what she said, uh, meron lang isang, parang bigla na lang siya sumulpot eh. Ako, for me, eh, parang sino to? Na, narinig ko siya, she was uh, singing in a, in a bar of a friend. Okay, in um, Mandaluyong. Ano lang, dumatambay lang kami doon. And then, nakita ko may kumakanta. Tapos, sobrang galing. Tapos, parang, sino to? Parang, parang hindi siya familiar. Yung mukha niya, hindi familiar. Yung boses niya, merong may, may character talaga. Tapos, sabi ko, um, tinanong ko yung friend ko, sino siya? Tapos, nagre-relieve lang daw siya. So, hinanap ko sa Facebook. Diba? Tapos, sinecheck out ko. Sino kaya to? Galing naman. Sino, sino mga kakilala niya? Ganyan. So, wala kami masyadong common friends. Which is, which is surprising. Kasi, in most ng mga singers pagka hinanap ko ang daming common friends so yun talaga parang napaka-unknown niya parang so, her met the most funny pa doon ang common friend namin yung father ko <laughs> ayo oh, nga no oo oo nick yeah parang na ko actually yung dad niya at saka yung y- yung family niya tapos parang oh it, siya pala ganyan ganyan anyway well, what happened was no merong time naman hinanapan ako ng gig ng isang friend ko sabi meron ka bang kilalang singer kasi kailangan ko ng duo. Tayo ko um at that time wala akong maiisip. Tapos nalala ko siya. Tapos parang sige, message ko lang Facebook lang. Hi, kanya. Tapos parang would you be interested in um, playing in a gig? Umuwi siya. Tayo ko, uy, cool. Sige. So nag-meet kami doon tapos yun from then parang nag-click talaga. Tapos parang yun na, we shared um common interests in music Correct. and ano yung we're both into motorcycles noon. Hanggang ngayon, actually. Tapos, That's where it really starts, no? Yung common interest. Yeah, Nagkiklik oh. agad, eh. Pag unang gig pa lang, pag alam mong click na, go mo na yun. Tama, tama. Hindi lahat may ganong magic ng chemistry. So there, from then, nice story. Na, she, she presented her original songs, tapos ginawa namin. Tapos parang, okay. Parang natuwa kami pareho. So, ang galing, that. eh. Ang galing nung, ano, yung um, set up. Like, punong-puno yung tunog. Yung di ka na maghahanap. Kasi the kind of music that you want to project, talagang nailabas doon sa music na, na piniplay ni Tim. So, uh, tama. So, sabi ko nga, mas, mas okay din talaga. Kasi nung una, sabi ko, hey, parang hindi ko kayang mag-isa na mag-play lang ng acoustic. Kasi nalilito ako mag-play ng guitar, tas kakanta ako. So, sabi ko, sige nga, maghahanap ako ng kabanda. <laughs> sabi ko nga na. <laughs> so, ayan. Yan. Ako naman, di, ra- di ako marunong kumanta. Sabi ko, kailangan ko ng kasam. <laughs> Ganun yun. <laughs> De, pero yun. Uh, pero, but yeah, I was trying to do my own thing as she was doing her own thing. Tapos parang nung nag-meet kami, biglang, uy, pagsamahin nga natin. So I was doing um, solo act. She was doing her acoustic stuff. So nung nagsama, merong parang something new. That's why it sounds yun, quite exactly. unique. Yun, exactly. Isa pa yun. Kasi I don't wanna sound like yung, okay. ma- uh, yung parang typical acoustic singer. So,
Ikaw ang nakikita Ano ba naman yan? Kay ganda ng umaga Ang iyong ngiti Nakakabighani Ang iyong mga matang nakapikit Unti-unting mumulat para sa
So there with is. your kind of sound, with your kind of music, do you still want to expand like in a full band or you're happy now with what with the sound that you're producing right now? Depende. Kasi right now, parang napag-usapan namin before. Sabi ko, parang okay naman na na tayong dalawa lang. Parang meron namang mag, mag-evolve naman yan. May mga mm. gadgets na ngayon. So uh-huh. like like his stuff na parang looping. Ako, I'm thinking of adding looping din sa voice ko para mas kumapal pa yung ano to. No? Excited ka, Ben. Excited ako. Mm. Saka yung ano, <laughs> girl talaga. <laughs> excited ako doon. Saka yung ano, um, ang tawag dito, we talked about it na parang kailangan ba natin ng, yun nga, marang, maraming elements sa pwedeng idagdag actually. And parang naging pitfall siya for, at least in my experience, parang dagdag ka ng dagdag na hindi mo naman man, naman maximize pa yung konti. So we tried to maximize muna with what we're doing now. Pag talagang meron na kaming hindi ma-achieve or ma- 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 makuha ng tunog na kailangan namin, that's when we will think of adding something else. Yun yun know. eh, yun yung artist in you guys. Diba? It's not really pampadami, but it's really how you want your sound to appear to your audience. Tsaka yung bayad, diba? Mas sa aming dalawa. Yun, yun. <laughs> yun, yun naman diba? ang business side nun. <laughs> oh, parang gusto ko na rin mag-downsize. <laughs>
Ganito. Ano ang naging challenges nyo? Ah? Kasi laki ng transition into looping, right? Kasi alam naman natin si Mila, yung, yung soul, di ba? So, paano kayo nag-come up na ganun? Medyo nahirapan ba kayo sa adjustment? Ano or... yung struggles along uh-huh. the way? I don't know. Actually, parang... Siguro ano, si yung rehearsals namin, hindi kami masyado nagkikita recently kasi nga I'm busy with my baby. So parang ganun, parang kakapangan ako lang ganyan. So hindi ako makapunta sa kan kasi before nakapunta ako sa kanila to rehearse. Um, ngayon medyo seldom na. So ang ginagawa namin, I make the the music, parang I write the lyrics, I write the song, tapos sinesend ko sa kanya para para malagyan niya ng sarili niyang flavor. So, ano pa din, parang bigayan pa din na, oh, ito na yung ano, ikaw na bahala, parang ganun. It's, Happy it's, problem pa rin, ano? Yeah, oh, exactly. It's, it's ano eh, um, may downside siya yung pagiging duo lang. Kasi, parang mas maraming work, parang mas maraming um, kailangang um, mental work, if you would, para lang magawa namin yung kailangan namin magawa. And, pero marami rin, um, Struggle siya pero marami rin advantage eh. Dahil nga, mas madali mag-set na schedule. Yep. Pag hindi pwede, pag hindi pwede yung isa, de, ano. Ayun. Ganyan lang. <laughs> Ayun. Sige, eto. Medyo tricky lang to. <laughs> pero hindi man tricky. Pero gusto namin, namin malaman, paano ba gawin yung <laughs> Akala style na yan? Ka. At ikaw talaga ang nagtanong. <laughs> Kasi di ba? Si Owen talaga yung interesado. <laughs> Medyo ano, di ba? Distinct, eh. Makakita mo siya pag sinabi mo Melina. Ah, okay. Mm. Ito siya. Mara, ito na yung chance, guys. Kasi marami na nagtatanong sa akin kung paano pa gawin yan never Oo kung nga, nagawa eh. mag-video to... Ano. So, wag ka magulat. Dahil fan mo nga ako. Wag ka magulat <laughs> kung ang profile pic ko, meron na na akong turban. <laughs> okay lang mo naman. Okay sabi lang. Nga, oh, yan. Sabi ko no, nga, game na. <laughs> Oo, share natin yan. Share yes. natin. Yes. Sige, Bago game. knowledge siya na. <laughs> so, okay lang gawin ko sa yes, ano. Yes, of course. <laughs> yung nagtanong. Ayun no, meron pa. Ayun oh. 101. Okay. Nangyayari na may pala. First. <laughs> dapat kasi naka ano, naka, naka dapat naka ban yung ah, okay. yung hair. Pero okay lang, okay lang. Okay lang. Willing talaga ako mag-adjust. <laughs> so, usually. Ganyan. Tapos, okay. tinatakpan ko yung tenga ko. Tsaka yung noo ko kasi malaking noo ko. Kaya guys, okay. wag kayong magugulat. Kaya pagka ano, hindi ako nakaturban, walang nakakilala sa akin. Kasi maganda ako pag nakaturban ako. <laughs> Grabe siya. Ayan. So, ano ba? Okay na ba yung sabi? Ah, yes. Pero gusto ko, mga friends niya, hindi ko nakikita. Hindi kilala, oo. Tapos, I twist it like this. Bakit kailangan takpan yung tenga? Wala lang. Wala lang. Ak- akala medyo, ko kasi... Medyo struggle. Yun ang struggle kasi minsan hindi ko naririnig yung sarili ko. <laughs> Yun. So, kailangan mo marinig, no? Uh, medyo okay. technical kasi si Meline. Lalo sa mga bosses niya, di ba? Usually, mas mataas pa yan. Pero... Yan. Tapos... Oh, guys ha, alam nyo na. Yeah. <laughs> Eric Abadu, nanood ka ba? Oh, yeah. <laughs> nanood yeah. ka ba, Eric Abadu? Ganito. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> De, pero itong this kind of, ano, parang tapatriangle ko siya ina. Mm. Ah, okay. so, may, may naka-fold lang sa harap. So, bahala ka uh, ko ano, uh, uh, paano mo siya gustong lobas. At dahil dyan, yeah. ang remembrance mo sa amin. Yes! Yeah. Kasi talagang naniningil kami ng souvenir oh. nito. So, eto na. Ipiplay ba ko na lang to para malaman ko. Thank you, thank guys! You. Thank, thank, you so thank, you, thank you Thank you, thank you, Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. So, be- yeah. so, paano? Pwede na nang i-promote ko yung yes, album please. niyo? Yes, oh, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so, you can follow our Facebook. Um, Facebook.com slash Melina Music, M-E-L-E-E-N-A Music. Instagram is Melina R-S. Tapos Spotify, you can follow uh, Bobby Sky Spotify to check out our songs. It's, sabi ko ba yung title? <laughs> uh, tapong ina mo. Um, you are not alone. <laughs> Tsaka ano, yung overdose. Ayan, so. Alright. Um, sa akin naman, Facebook. Pag-search na lang yung Tim Kada, T-I-M-C-A-D-A. 
So meron akong profile, meron din akong uh, like page, so paki-like. And also Instagram tim_kada. underscore kada. So yun, yung mga ano, mga worthy kong pictures tungkol yan lang. Yeah, yung mga yeah. worthy kong pictures. Yeah, alam na. So yun, uh, Spotify wala pa. Now hopefully we'll yes. put something out soon. We'll soon, watch soon, out soon. for that. Yep. We'll watch out thank for you. that. All right, thank you so much for having us here. Uh, subscribe na lang sa kanila. Thank you so much. And the voices PH. Super galing ni Melina. Alam mo, the entire time, nakatutok lang ako sa performance. Hindi nga halata sa itsura mo niyan eh. Alam mo, ang laki ng influensya ni Melina sa'yo. <laughs> Pinag-aralan ko talaga kung paano niya ginawa yung turban niya eh. Hindi, joke lang. Seriously, Owen, grabe yung music style niya. Alam mo, bukod sa stage presence niya, yung character niya, ibang-iba yung pagkaka-execute niya ng music niya na kahit na hindi mo alam yung lyrics, dalang-dala ka sa storya. Yun yung originality and music content niya. Correct, mismong-mismo. Kaya promise namin sa inyo, ganyan ka panalo ang mapapanood nyo every week dito sa Indie Voices PH. That is why we are plugging them in, amplifying their music, their words, their voices, so that we may hear the sound of the future of Pinoy music today. Plug, amplify, resonate, We, We are Indie, Indie Voices, Voices PH. PH. Thank you. Adios. Get her set.